Hey guys, Dustin here, CEO of 630. Today I'm here with our lovely model, Alana. And today we're gonna talk a little bit about the best bike sizes for women. Um, there's a lot that goes into choosing the right bike size, especially your height, um, your body shape, um, arm length, leg length, things like that. So it can sometimes be challenging to find the exact bike that's right for you. Now, the good thing about 630 bikes is our bikes are generally made to be able to be adjusted for a varying um, height range. I would say most of our bikes can suit women um, five feet to about 5'11", um, depending on how you adjust the seat or the handlebars. Anything, any women taller or shorter than that um, really are going to need to explore um, either a larger bike um, or a shorter bike. So let me show you right here, we have the Every Journey 26 inch women's. Alana is actually five foot one. So we're gonna have her get on the bike and we're gonna show you how she fits this bike. Now, Alana and I spoke right now, she's not mic'd up right now, so you won't be able to hear her as well. But we spoke before this video and she said that I ride a 26 inch bike. Now, at her height, it can really depend on um, if you're comfortable on a 26 inch or not, depending on arm length and leg length also. So you're gonna see Alana hop on. Now we have the seat all the way down and go ahead and put your right foot down. Now you can see she's actually in a great riding position. Zoom in on those toes right there. Nice. So you can see she's up on the pad of her toes, which is exactly what you want. Um, now any, any lower might be too low. Um, any tall, any higher would be too high. So you can see she needs the seat all the way down. So somebody who's five foot, they could still ride the 26 inch as well. Um, however, they're gonna be a little bit more on their tippy toes. So if you have shorter legs, I would definitely recommend a 24 inch if you're five feet. Now, if you're five feet and you'd say you'd have average legs, leg length or average arm length, 26 inch should be great for you. Um, so yeah, you can see everything is perfect for her. Back's upright, leg is great, um, arms bent and relaxed and um, She's ready to ride. Now, hop off this one, Alana, and I'm gonna bring in the 24 inch. Now, it's not to say that Alana couldn't ride a 24 inch or to say that some women may not be better suited for a 24 inch, but it's, it's a little bit of personal preference. So you can see on this one, the seat is higher. So she's actually now about in the same foot position on the 24 inch as she was on the 26 inch um, because of the seat height. So this is gonna give her a little bit more flexibility in terms of she could lower the seat a little bit more. So it's gonna give her um, a wider variance of adjustment potential. Um, you can also see she, this bike fits her pretty well. Um, so again, it's really personal preference. The, the, the women that are five feet, five one range it's a personal preference between a 24 inch or a 26 inch. Um, and then also if you have shorter arms or shorter legs, that's gonna depend too. Shorter arms or shorter legs, if you're five foot or five one, I'd recommend a 24 inch. If you believe your legs are average length, 26 inch is a great bike. So uh, Alana's gonna take off and go for a ride here. Remember, um, check out our website. You can enter your dimensions in our body fit tool. You put in your height and your weight and it'll give you the thumbs up or thumbs down on all of our bikes. Don't mind Alana, she'll be all right. It'll give you a thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs down on all of our bikes. It will tell you if you're a fit to that particular bike. <coughs> if you have any questions, feel free to email or call us and uh, we can help you get fitted perfectly to your body because that's what we want to do here at 630 is make every bike fit perfect to your body. And Alana will be okay, I promise. <laughs>